What is cracking, guys? It's your boy, Mod Junkie, here. And today we're going to be reacting to the top seven Jeep Renegade mods, slash modification, slash accessories. Someone just sent me this video on this super sick Jeep Renegade that's fully modified. And I'm kind of excited to deep dive into it. Um, so let's deep dive into it. Um, this is his video. And this guy has a one of the sexiest uh, Jeep Renegades I've ever seen. And he's just kind of going through the list of modifications on this beast. And as you can see, this thing is fully modded to the gills. And the first mods I want to say are the front grill, the cow catcher. Um, this thing is super rad. Like this, this will make or break any like ATV off-road vehicle. And I'm glad whoever sent this to me sent this to me because I'm really digging this thing. I know sometimes the Jeep Renegades kind of get like a bad reputation. Um, so he's got the super front, uh, what would you call it? Uh, a cow catcher, something like that front bumper. I, I'm guessing it's a custom all in one front bumper bush guard. Super sexy. And the next modification, I want to say he's going to go. I mean, this thing's decked out to the gills. I'm loving it. Um, the next one is going to be the side marker things. Not sure what those even are. Um, ooh, okay, okay. Yeah, still don't know. Then he's going to go with the snorkel. The snorkel is a good option. It kind of gives it that ATV off-road look. Um, I don't know. You guys will have to hit me up in the comments. Are you guys agreeing with me? I'm not really sure. Um, I'm not super into like the off-roading scene. I mean, I can appreciate this stuff and love it. Um, I, I I have heard from some people snork the snorkel gives it a different sound. It seems that it's super secure, high quality. Um, you got to get yourself some meaty tires. That's third on the list. Um, uh, these are the best modifications for your Jeep Renegade. Yeah, dude, get yourself some meaty wheels. I'm not sure if that's a stock OEM wheel. No idea. Again, we're just reacting to the video here, and looks like he's probably got some aftermarket aftermarket suspension. I'm guessing um, people that are buying these things, the what they first want to do is lift it because everybody wants that lifted look with the rock crawlers, right? <laughs> All right. Yeah, this thing's really sexy. Props. By the way, I want to give a shout out to the name of this channel that we're reacting to. It's Matthew Mitchell. You have the sexiest modified Jeep Renegade Desert Hawk I've seen on the interwebs, which is saying a lot. Ooh, boy, he's got the LEDs in there. That's... That is the fourth modification on the list, guys. You got to get them LEDs inside of the wheel wells. No, I'm not sure if that's a necessity. It's really going to be up to you. Pretty cool, though. Oh, it's connected to his phone. Oh, he's a bad boy. He's probably getting so many chicks. So many chicks. <laughs> All right, so the next mod is a roof rack. That's actually pretty badass. I'll give him that. And he's got the light bar attached to it. And... Yeah, these these Jeeps just they look sick. Yeah, he's got that. I think he's hiding the wire inside there because a lot of times you got to hide, try to hide the wire. He's got the window tint. This thing's just fully decked out. Oh, there's the little switch for it. Um, Yeah, here's him turning on the light bar. Pretty satisfied with that. Um, I'm not a fan of light bars because some some of the people around here like to turn them on while you're driving and it's just like they just blind you and you're about to drive in the ditch. But maybe that's just me. He's got the shovel there in case the Jeep gets stuck. No, I'm kidding. All jokes aside, I am kidding. All right. So what else have we got here? We got the roof rack. Let's get into something spicy here. A lot of stickers. You got to add some stickers. Yeah, this thing is sexy. I'm going to give him props. All right. Looks like he painted the engine cover. I mean, you have to do that. I don't know if that's one of the mods on my list because I don't know if I agree with that. Jeez Louise. He's got some wires, man. He's got stuff hooked up like crazy. Get yourself a tow hook. Get yourself some of the built-in hooks. I don't know if those actually come with it or not. I doubt it. Hmm. Got yourself some interior LEDs. That's always a good option. And I'm sure he's got a banging sound system because this dude's younger. Ooh, the moonroof. I like that. Yeah, guys, this is a... Pr Ooh, the subwoofer. Go back, go back, go back. 
toaster. That's his that's his vanity license plate toaster. That's hilarious, dude. I'm going to give props to this dude. This is a clean looking vehicle. Props, props, props. There's that subwoofer. Actually, maybe it's not a subwoofer. It could just be a decent size um, speaker. All right, guys. Um, Jeep Renegade modifications. Top seven of them. We gave you about 15 of them. Uh, again, I want to give a shout out to this dude. Who's the owner of this channel. Super cool. One of the coolest Jeep renegades I've seen. And, uh, Matthew Mitchell, check out his channel. If you want to subscribe, he's got some killer, killer mods here. Sorry. I didn't show you here. It is, uh, Matthew Mitchell. Um, super happy. Someone sent this to me. Uh Oh, he's about to do some off roading. Is he, are we getting to it? You going to show us something, boy. You going to show us something. Ooh, he is. God, I knew I liked this guy a lot. Look at this. We thought this video was over. Full screen this. Beach. Yeah, I like this guy a lot, dude. <laughs> he's like uh he's like the warehouse manager like you always wanted or something. Yes, yes. Stop it there. That's how the video should end. Super, super sexy. Check out his channel, guys. Let me know in the comment section what you think. Matthew Mitchell's channel. This is the top 7 to 10 Jeep Renegade modifications, accessories, mods. This thing is modified to the gills. By the way, uh, if you guys want to have me react to a video on cars or something, just hit me up in the comments. I will see you in the next one.